So I figure I've got a lot of uh, fountain pen videos in the future I can make because fountain pen collecting, uh, one thing I have loved about it is that um, there are beautiful pens that are very inexpensive and there are beautiful pens that are very expensive. There are some pens that I aspire to own that are $1,000 or more, some $500 in that range, and then there are some beautiful pens that are $30, like this Wing Sung 626, the gold dot. It looks like the Schaefer Balance. So we're gonna talk about that. I got it for Christmas. I <laughs> gave myself a pen. Um, and I, 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 it's in this red cellulite, it's plastic that looks like cellulite, and twists off, very light pen. Um, I'm not gonna do like size comparisons, I'll show you in my hand, and we'll, but we'll do some writing samples that will look really nice. Um, but this pen, uh, of course, Chinese made pen to look like the Schaefer Balance, but I, to me, I've always been the type that I've loved things like the red, the gold dot, and what that meant to the Schaefer pens, but it's cool. I, I like it in my pocket. Like, look at that. It fit. There we go. Oh, isn't that nice? That's so nice. And, uh, and it writes like a dream. I believe, my eyesight's not very good, I believe this is a fine nib. I'm trying to see if I see an F on it. We'll take a look at that. But it writes like a fine, uh, it's very, very, it writes very well. I mean, it writes comparable to my very expensive pens. It's, it's, a, it's been a beautiful, fun pen to have. Now, as I've said many times when I've done my fountain pen videos, the reason I'm into fountain pen collecting is because I've discovered handwriting in my 50s. I had terrible handwriting, and I decided to try and ch change that. I've learned to write with my right hand. I used to be left-handed. I've learned to write cursive and I really enjoy it and I have this very beautiful journal that I that I keep it is a paper blanks you know with its leather cover it's just really stunning and we're gonna make a journal entry here and uh, and I'll I'll uh, we'll talk about this pen and how well it write okay so here we are in my paper blanks journal and my wingsung 626 gold dot and see how it fits in my hand there very nicely um, I, I it does it cap does it post I mean it kind of posts it doesn't fit real securely and uh, it doesn't look very good so I'm not gonna post it so today is the ninth one nine twenty one Saturday wet a nice, I think I have Diamine Twilight in this. Doing a YouTube video to tell about my wing sung 626 gold dot fountain and I really like it I mean it's very wet the ink is just shining in the light here um, one thing that is interesting to say about this pen of course it's got this kind of um, uh, two-tone nib but it's a steel nib you know it's for 30 bucks it wasn't a gold nib but it's right writes really really nicely um, it was a hard pen to find there were times when I would look on Amazon and 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 Google search it and it wasn't available but in December it was and I quickly ordered one I'm really enjoying this pen but I should really concentrate on writing more neatly since this video is going up on the interweb. Um, I'm an old guy. Have you been enjoying Cobra Kai? You know, that's my era. Those those actors are my age and I love that movie. And this Cobra Kai has been really good. Should we, should we put that in here? Cobra Kai has been really fun to watch. By the way, 
I'm doing this video while wearing my Seiko SKX009. Quick watch plug. I'm wearing my Seiko SKX009. I, I've been trying, I like watches and pens. That's, the, that's kind of what I do. Um, let's see. If you, if you go to my other YouTube channel, D B Mangum is my other YouTube channel. I just posted a banjo video. Yeah, I, I play the banjo and tell stories in my other hobby, and I posted a song on the banjo on my other YouTube channel. I'm a storyteller by passion. Um, I've also been writing letters. I got some new fancy stationery, which I'll show in another video. I'm writing letters to my kids and other loved ones and grandkids. Um, this pen has a fine nib, I think. It didn't say in the in the Amazon purchase. I, I don't recall it saying that. It's like, oh, I know what let's do. Let's look at it with reading glass. And sure enough, there is an F on that nib. This is a fine nib, definitely. Today has been a nice day, but we could sure use some snow. You know what? Collecting fountain pens and having a journal is an important thing. You may not think that you have anything important to say to the world or to leave to posterity. You do. It's always wonderful to leave a journal and, and one day people will read it and find it fascinating. You put things in it that you don't think are very interesting. One day people will love it. I'm still thinking about buying a new electric guitar. And if I do, I'll do a video about that. Episone, Epis, Epiphone ES335. So, um, sitting here at my little desk, my little uh, slide out platform here, is something I really enjoy. And I've really enjoyed this. Wingsung 626 Gold Dot. Very, very, very beautiful pen. There we go. Very fun pen to have. I've enjoyed carrying around in my pocket. As much as I have carrying expensive pens that I own, this has been a nice pen to own.